The jury heard an emotional 911 call from an 11 year old girl whose mother was shot and killed inside their southern Indiana home last year. WDRB Stefan Johnson explains the one thing the prosecution and defense attorneys agree on in this case. Stefan. Well, good afternoon, guys. Behind me, our cameras were allowed inside a Clark County courtroom for opening statements in the murder trial of Mac Lewis. Both sides agree Lewis had a gun and his wife was shot and killed, but how and why is where they disagree. Lizzie was in the closet, and Mac raised the gun, and he shot Lizzie over and over and over and killed her. And her body lay on the floor of that closet, the blood pooling everywhere. I think that makes sense that what he says happened, happened. And that is that he did put a gun to his head that was loaded in an attempt to cause Lizzie to drop the divorce or not pursue that. Uh, yes, he, he knew uh, based upon his family, his history with, the, with her family, that her brother fused before had committed suicide. Mac Lewis is on trial for the murder of his wife, Elizabeth Lewis. She's also known as Lizzie. She was shot and killed inside the couple's home in Sellersburg in April of last year. In opening statements, prosecutors described how the victim's 11-year-old daughter witnessed the murder and then called 911. The defense claims Lewis was holding the gun but to his own head and threatening suicide after being told his wife wanted a divorce. Tinsley had heard her mom say, call 911, call 911. And she heard the shots and she ran out and saw Mac coming out. She described him as being very angry and his eyes being red. And she cried out, you shot my mom. We agreed on some things, as I said in my opening, that they went into the room. Um, she passed away, she died in the room. And the, the question is really what happened in there. After hearing that emotional 911 call, the jury was dismissed for the day. The trial is scheduled to resume at 8.30 on Wednesday morning. All right, we'll stay with it through the verdict. Thanks, Stefan.